Hi guys, in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how you can add or how you can list multiple variations on eBay listing. Okay, so you can add a product with different sizes, with different colors. Um, you can do that easily when you are trying to list the product on eBay. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys how you can do that. So first, I'm going to click on sell. Okay, which is going to act like I'm going to sell something. I'm going to click on create listing, single listing. Now, after that, what you guys need to do, I'm just, just uh, like, like start listing the product. Now I'm going to list a random product like this product. I'm going to copy the title. Or anyway, click on search, this icon here. Continue without match. I'm going to select new. Like you can just select here if it's used. If you are listing a used item, click on used, select used. And then after that, what you guys need to do, keep in mind that not all like not all listings are going to be eligible to like to, for that okay they, they are not going to be eligible to create multiple variations not all listings are eligible for that okay so first what you guys need to do is three little dots in the top right click on them click on settings and as you can see variations now you want to make sure you toggle on as you can see uh like to, so that you can create a listing with different sizes different colors you know just toggle this on if it's off toggle it on as you can see list different variations of the item including different colors sizes limited to qualifying item categories so not all categories are qualified to 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 list the items like with different variations okay so only a few categories are eligible for that now you can also click on learn more to learn the eligible categories for to, for creating listing with different variations now i'm going to click on drop and file i'm going to click for add the, the product pictures here okay that's what i'm going to do right now as you can see these are the product pictures. now if you scroll down here as you can see variations now if you can see here variations that's good okay if you can see it here I'm going to go back. I'm going. To, I'm actually. Uh, okay. I'm going to. Sorry. I'm going to go back to the exact same settings. Anyway, I'm going to add again the product pictures. All right. Now, after you add the product pictures, if you scroll down a little bit, you will see her variations. Okay. If you cannot see it, what I recommend is changing the category of your products here, where it says item category. Change it to some another category, and hopefully you will see here this variations option or section here now if you cannot see it that means this the product you are trying to list is not eligible for variations okay now if you can see it just click on edit or click on variations okay click on it now i'm going to remove this color and mpn remove it and here i'm going to add click on add and click on select which one whatever you want i'm going to add my own i'm going to add here color click on save now, if you have an item with different colors, I'm going to add here color, okay. Colors, for example. It seems like it's not allowing me because they already gave me here color option. Now, if you if you are not, if you can't find it, then you will be able to add color, okay. Now, after you add here color, you can also add, for example, say size, okay. Click on save. You can also add different like sizes, different colors. As you can see, when you click on color, then you can select your options. If you can find, if you cannot find the color here, you can just click on create your own. For example, green. You can add green color. As you can see, it's already here. As you can see, I'm going to select here green. Okay, beige. Okay, uh, blue. Uh, gold, gray, green. Now, as you can see, th these are the colors I have selected. Okay. Now you can also click on size, and then you can create, for example, XL. Okay. Size. I'm going to add uh, M size, for example. But I don't have an, a product with different sizes. I only have a diff uh, like product with different colors. So I'm going to remove sizes here. Size. Now I only have a product product with. Uh, blue color and gold color and, and uh, gray color okay like four different colors now after you are finished click on continue 
okay nice now you're gonna scroll down and you want to click here it says use default colors you can also add the specific color for each color you can add an image so if someone like your customers visit your product page if they click on the color you want which is like blue or gold if they click on it immediately you will see the the color of the product now you want to click here on color and here for the blue color you want to add an, an image for the blue color and the gold color click on the gold color here or whatever color you selected and you need to click and add the, an image specifically for that color uh, here gray specifically for that color here okay here the green you want to select here and a color the specifically green Okay, of course, this is not green. This is just an example. Of course, after you click on the color, you want to add the product that is green. Okay, so here where it says the price, you can also add the price here for the, the product. If you have a product with different sizes, you can also like change the prices. Like for example, the blue color, I want to sell this for $10, but the gold color, I want to sell it for $12 or $11. Okay, gray color, I want to sell it for $11. Okay. The green color i want to sell it sell it for 20 dollars of course this is not going to be this different just because the color is different the difference uh, different in price just because the color is different of course uh uh it's not this i just i'm trying to show you guys the example that's it okay so after you are finished then you want to click on save and close now you have successfully created an item with different variations uh, like it could be different colors different sizes okay as you can see the colors you can see four different colors now we just need to add here the product specifications like the shipping time and handling time after you are finished click on list it and that, that's it that's exactly guys how you can create a product with different colors different sizes that's exactly how you can do this uh, if you need any help please go to the comments below and tell me exactly what your questions are i reply to every single comment okay see you guys in the next video please drop a like and see you guys next one